Hello, in this video let us see how to establish ZigBee communication using Arduino Nano and NodeMCU. When one is familiar with architecture of ZigBee and ZigBee protocols, one can move on to wireless communication between two XB modules. In this tutorial, let us take that step and learn how to establish ZigBee communication using Arduino boards. Installing XCTU software to set up configure and test your XP devices, you need XCTU software. It is an easy to use free multi-platform application for RF XB modules. Download the XCTU software, the link is in the article and it will guide you how to install it as well. After that, open the application and make sure your XP module is connected properly. Check the COM port of the Explorer board in Device Manager. Now, let us see how the transmitting side of the ZigBee communication works. For this, let us use a push button to send data. So, connect one end of the push button to D5 of the Arduino and the other end of the push button to ground pin. Connect VCC pin of XB module to 3.3 volt of Arduino Nano and ground pin of XB module to Arduino Nano ground. These two connections make up for powering the transmitting side of the XB module. Now, connect D out pin to D2 of Arduino Nano and D in pin to D3 pin of Arduino Nano. For receiving side of the ZigBee communication, connect ground pin of XB module to ground pin of Node MCU and connect VCC pin of XB module to VCC pin of Node MCU. The above mentioned two connections supply the power to the XB module as well. D out pin of XB is connected to D6 pin of Node MCU and D in pin of XB is connected to D7 pin of Node MCU. These two pins are for receiving the data. As an indication whether the data is received or not, we will use an LED. For this, connect the LED anode to D2 of Node MCU and LED cathode to ground through a 220 ohm resistor. Now let us see how to install the firmware to XB modules. Firmware should be installed in both the XP modules first. For that, we are using XP development board. Step 1. Open XCTU software and click on discover boards. Step 2. Select the COM port to which the XB module is connected and click on next. Step 3. Keep the default settings and click on finish. Step 4. Now, on the pop-up window, click on add selected devices. Now the XP module will appear on the left side of the window, click on it to update the user interface. Now to update the firmware, click on update. Select 802.15.4th in the function set and select the newest firmware in firmware version and click on it to update. After this, a pop-up window will appear, click on yes. Enter any 4 digits as PAN ID. PAN ID is Personal Area Network Identifier. Each network must be given a unique ID. Hence, make sure that for both XP modules the same PAN ID is entered. This indicates that both the XP modules are in the same network. Give any 4 digits for destination address. This same number must be entered as a source address for the other XP module. Give any 4 digits for the source address and this same number must be entered as destination address for the other XP module. Set one device as coordinator and set the other device as end device. Now click on write in the top bar. After that is successful, the symbol changes from E to C, that is from end device to coordinator as we have set it. For the other module, the same procedure must be followed but with the changes mentioned. Let us see the working of the project. In an overview, two XP modules are used to establish ZigBee communication. An Arduino Nano and Node MCU is used to communicate between both the XB devices. The XB modules are coded such that when a push button is pressed on the transmitter side, the LED is lit on the receiving side. This indicates that the data transmitted at source is received properly at the destination. Thank you. Thank you.